more of a this stuff I care about, this stuff I don't care about at all. Yeah, and, and yep. ENTJ seems quicker at they're like, okay, not this, okay, this, yes, and the, so they're I think their trolling is more like quick and like instant. I don't know. My brother is an ENTJ, actually. Yeah, so he probably has well, you know, if he's in a particularly good mood, he'll probably start fucking around with you. Yeah. Exactly. Or whoever. Yeah. But just it's it's just on the spot kind of thing. Right. It's sporadic. It's uh, it's good natured. Yeah. There's not a lot of room for her feelings of ENTJ trolling. <laughs> No, it's so fast. It's so like, I don't know. It's just, if just something. Playing. They're just playing. Yeah, they're just playing. Well, and like, if I'm thinking of a game, like, I don't think trolling should even be a term to be used. Like, it's a game. Who cares? Do whatever you want. Lots of people care. I hate that. <laughs> like, that, that's why I want to mess with the people is because I care too much. That's what I said. Also, people's comfort zones are under the bed. What's that? People's comfort zones? What did you yep. say? Yes. Yeah. I guess it's also developing like um, a sense of where, how how to cross people's boundaries just enough, you know, because if, if you go too far, you know, there's a sensitivity that you need to have in order to know how far you can go in order for, the, for it to still be a, a game, you know. Can the term trolling be used in a real life context or is it only internet lingo or internet context? I think it happens all the time in real life too, but internet is like the perfect playground, isn't it? For... Yes. Is that Taylor making that noise? I think so. Uh, which one? There's a fan in this room. Okay. It sounded like like you got a paper cutting board or something, you're like cutting it or something. I don't know. It sounded weird. I have not been cutting any paper. Do you find like you developed a skill in through life, like getting better at seeing where people's lines were, like you know, when you cross somebody's border or line. How do you say that in English? Cross you know, like the line, yeah. People's comfort Yes, zone. I do. Like how people's like, soft spots or whatever. And, you know, were you a bit rougher when you were younger? And then oh, did yeah. you learn how to fine tune it? I wouldn't say I've gotten better at instantly, at quickly assessing it. I've just gotten a bit more measured at implementing my fuckery. I mean, I've gotten better in the sense of I know how much I can get away with without getting a boot. Are you still suspended from college? <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I mean, they dropped it to a warning instead of a you know, probation. What did you do? I'm, I'm, they, well, my professor called me racist in class. There's a video on it. I talked about it. It's like 40-something minutes long, maybe. Mm. Why did she racist. call you a racist? So I made a, a comment about two Muslim individuals um, in California who said it was a religious right to rape non-Muslim women on their property um, because of what the Constitution says regarding freedom of religion. And then Surah 23.6, among other passages, they interpreted that as, you know, Muslims are able to rape non-Muslim women um, which, I mean, I think that's true. I think they do assert that. But I said, regardless of that, um, I'm just talking about these two Muslim individuals and, you know, their culture. Um, it's not really racism, though, because... It's not right, racist. And I, brought that, yeah. I said it's a religion, so I don't know how I can be racist. 
Yeah, it's not a race, it's a religion. It's yeah. almost racist to assume that it's a race. Yeah. And then, so it was like a discussion in, in class or what was it? Yeah, it was a discussion based upon or based on assimilation. Um, so it's, it, it's a history class, right? So we were talking about humoralism, um, it's like a medieval Renaissance, early modern philosophy based upon Aristotelian medicine, um, where if one were to travel to a different environment, that environment can change your skin color, um, your morals, as well as partaking in another culture's foods and dress, et cetera. So the, both the environment and the culture of a different area can affect your moral system and your skin color and your identity, basically. Um, and then she uh, you know, talked about that in the context of assimilation and then talked about assimilation during the modern day. Um, asked the class what they thought American identity meant first and they said you know speaking English American dream stuff like that um, and then she talked about how you know assimilation has been used as a tool of oppression and it's evil by the dominant group in society over the you know minority group and she's an idiot she, she asked the class what they thought and everyone agreed with her that it's evil besides me and I said there's like both, both negative and positive aspects to it and so the first you, one being so you were basically video. discussing the topic yeah i answered a question then she gasps oh right you're a racist i'm not going to tolerate that kind of racism in my class mark and she said you know welcome to trump's new america where straight white males can say whatever they want without being reprimanded for it um, stuff like that i mean hillary clinton's married to a rapist so there's yeah. that what did you say, Taylor? Hillary Clinton is married to a rapist, so there's that. Um, yeah, what was that? Did did he rape her? Like, did he rape somebody else, or what was the thing with there, that? There, there have been a lot of hushed accusations, actually, from a lot of different women. This isn't a new thing. Yeah, it's no, not I nice under the thing. I wouldn't but want to Trump come out and say that. that. They're both rapists. Trump raped people too, didn't he? Isn't there stuff no, there? he made a stupid comment. He assault. He did like no, some he, sexual. He like, made a. Stuff. He talked. No, he just talked about grabbing pussy. It was literally the phrase. No, I saw something else about like women who had been not raped by him, but like touched by him in inappropriate. Well, I mean, like depending on what you read, I don't know. I did, I didn't see I, that. No, I, I don't know. History. I mean, I never. There's met some him. scary partisan websites out there. But yeah, no, I don't think so. Not that I've heard of. Personally, I would not want to run against a Democrat ever because it's there seems to be a trend. Anyways. Well, so that teacher kind of uh, overreacted a bit, Mark. Or yeah, then there was another incident where I was reading my Bible before class. And, you know, she basically kicked me out of class because I was reading my Bible. And it was before class even what? started. Yeah. Yeah. Well, in a short, as and a short were, version. It was what was exactly that? You were right about assimilation. But what, were the, yeah. what was the reason for that? Weren't you allowed to read whatever you want? Like, what? Yeah, I mean, I should be able to read Mein Kampf in front of the class before it starts, you know? Like, wh wh why does it matter what it is? That's crazy. I don't know. It sounds so like you assimilation is racist. No problem with you or something. What's that? It sounds like she has some kind of personal problem with you or something. Yeah. That'll happen your whole life. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just. Just get out yeah, your type eight and yeah. whack them with it. Yes. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But 
you have to really do it. History is full of successful women and places of the world to grow the world. That's all we I don't know if you're talking Taylor to us or someone else, but. Uh, yeah, Sounds like he's talking to someone else. But I am about to hop off here. Yeah, let's be real. Good luck, Mark. Let me know if I can write this letter. <laughs> but, yeah. Okay, so Taylor left? Okay. <laughs> I think he left, yeah. Yeah. I'll be back in a second. Subject. 